liftoff of the 25th Space Shuttle mission and it has cleared the tower. On January 28, 1986, teacher Krista McCulloch was on board the Space Shuttle Challenger. She was headed into space where she would teach lessons to school children around the world. 73 seconds into that mission, Challenger exploded. Today, 31 years later, Krista and her fellow astronauts are touching the lives of students through the Challenger Learning Center in Schenectady, New York. An intensive STEM two and a half hour simulated mission to space that explore, helps, has kids explore space and the science and technology involved in engineering. It also builds teamwork and develops workforce skills. There are currently five centers located in New York State and 43 around the world. A trip to the Challenger Learning Center brings classroom lessons to life. It's a trip into space. Stand by while we get the answer for this problem. Over. Over. Based on NASA astronaut training, students take part in a simulated mission to space. Soft dock. In an innovative learning environment. Using teamwork and communication is important because you can you can learn a lot more. You have to be patient and you take what you learn from today and you can use it in the future. The Challenger Learning Center missions present students with learning environments embedded with activities and lessons aligned with common core state standards. I hope they walk away with um, the opportunity that Maybe they could be one day be an astronaut and come to work for NASA or be that engineer or a computer science person or anything, even within public affairs of interviewing, that they can solve problems that they never knew they could because this taught them to think critically. The goal of the Challenger Center is to educate future leaders and innovators who will help advance and improve the quality of life for generations to come. Reporting for NISBA News, I'm Casey Nicholson.